hi welcome back to my youtube channel it's your favorite and friendly tech youtuber mr furry here in this video i'll show you how to download and install microsoft office for free the whole process is going to be for free we are not going to be downloading any pirated file or we are not going to do anything illegal so the whole process is going to be for free and at the end of the video you'll be able to install microsoft office have the latest features of it and run it perfectly well on your laptop but i have a big question for you even before the big question if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel don't also forget to turn on that notification bell and also don't forget to like because the algorithm works in a way that the more you like a video the more others get to see it the big question is that is that are you still paying for microsoft office every month don't get me wrong it's a good thing to pay and purchase microsoft products and also their services but the truth of the matter is that what if your your money or whatever uh, investment you have cannot last on that subscription for a long time then it means that this video is actually for you and also let's say you've been using microsoft products uh, i mean the older versions for a very long time like microsoft office 2016 and also um microsoft microsoft office professional plus 2021 the problem is that the the problem is that outdated software doesn't just limit your features okay but also it can lead you to i mean exposure which is some security vulnerabilities since it is no longer receiving updates from microsoft so it can lead you to some security vulnerabilities if you are staying on the older versions of 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 softwares i want you to keep in mind that technology keeps moving forward and that's the reason why you need to be updating your your machine you need to be abreasting yourself with the latest technologies that is being i mean released so in this video i'm going to show you how to install and download the microsoft office i mean the latest one actually so let's go in straight into the solution so first of all we will go to our settings and then we go to apps then we look for we search for microsoft office we are done with that we uninstall so the motive is that we have to uninstall any or all the the microsoft office the the previous office whatever that we have we need to uninstall it so i am doing mine so you just uninstall it so i am doing that so you ensure you do this before you continue with the whole thing and please don't skip any part of this video so we will wait for the the latest uninstallation process to be done so right after uninstalling your previous microsoft office the next thing you'll be doing is that go to your file manager and then you locate your local disk which which can be your disk disk normally this disk c okay so when you go to the disk c all you need to do is to create a folder and you name it maybe microsoft office so let's say microsoft um office 2024 or even 2025 yeah, but like i just want to do 2024 microsoft office 2024 let's just do 2025 because we are currently 2025 then the next thing we are also going to do is that we go on google and then we search for microsoft LTC, ltsc professional plus 2024 download then the first link that appears we click on it don't worry i'm going to provide you with every link that you need and every i mean every resource and every link that you need will be in the description so you just watch out for that so after we, are, we, are, we click on the first link we come here and then here are the basic steps for deploying whatever and then you click on this particular link download the office deployment tool from the microsoft download center so we are about to download an office deployment tool which would help us to um, to download the main setup okay or to, to install the main setup so you click on download and then you hit on 
okay so i'm downloading microsoft so i just do okay continue and i'll do yes so all i need to do is close this one for now and then the next thing i'll do is that i'll go to where i saved or where my downloads appears okay so mine will be at uh, downloads here so you, i'm sure when you download yours it will also be at wherever you normally when you download it goes to and then you come to I, I will go to programs and then this is where mine is located so the next thing we are going to be doing is to install this particular um, deployment tool so you double click on it and then the prompt that comes you go to yes and then the next thing you do is you hit on you accept the terms and conditions and then you go to continue so now here they will ask you where you want to install the office deployment tool so the next thing you do is that you you go straight to the folder that you created which was the microsoft um, office 2025 or whatever name you, you gave it and you install this to or this whatever setup to that particular folder so the next thing i do is okay and then the next thing you see is file files extracted successfully so let me go back to my office 20 25 and you realize that now we have two files here right good so let's go to the next thing so we are almost done so the next thing we'll do is that um when i come here the next thing we'll do is to to okay so we now need to create a configuration xml file so this is another place that we have, will come to you you search for microsoft customization tool so you just do customization tool customization tool and then the first link that appears don't worry i'm going to provide this link also in the description you click on this link and after you click on this link you you select the 64 which is already selected for you and then you go to what product are you i mean installing the reason why we are doing this is because we need some um particular product id and product key and all that and after we are done with this process automatically it generates that for us you get it so it means you are going to be using the microsoft for a very long time without needing to get alliances or anything so over here we select the office ltsc professional 2024 volume lances we select that one and then we 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 leave this as default and then we come here so this one too is up to you is your individual preferences whatever you want to select i personally don't need access for anything i also don't really need one drive a one note i need excel i, I don't well i need outlook at a point at a time okay and then one drive two i don't need it for now so i think this foil is good for me you can take all for for you for yourself if only you'll be needing them and then the language to you come here and select the united states so the next thing we'll do is that we go to we click on next and yes all of this will be default for us and the next step is to hit on export after you hit on export this particular pane will open for you and then you select office open X xml format so we want to export this in an xml format and then hit on ok now you have to accept the terms and conditions of the lances and then please this name leave it this way just leave it this way and you export it now when you export this file it appears in your downloads whatever so all you need to do is that where this file was downloaded to you copy this file so i am copying this file now you copy this file and you paste it 
in your Microsoft Office 2025 folder. So I'll paste it here. Good. And then you delete the first one that came with the with the I mean with the office to I mean office deployment to install. So you delete this one and you maintain the one that you just pasted. So I'm deleting this one. Let me the process for you to see. So I delete this one. Good. Now this is the this is the last step we are about to do. We are about to run a particular script, not not really anything but just one line of code to in our terminal or our command prompt to tell the our laptop that okay fine we want you to run this setup for us using this configuration file okay we want you to run this setup for us using this configuration file so the next thing we do is that i want you to actually understand what is happening okay and if there's anything you can write it in the comment section so we'll do command prompt and then the command we run this as a, the administrator so we go to yes and then over here we would um go into the folder that we saved our files you get it so there's no need you just need to come to where your folder is and then the, you copy the file path so you click on this this part this empty side of the file path and then you copy this file path i am copying this right now so i copy and then um when i come to so i do cd that's i'm changing directory into this particular folder then there you go now we are in the folder so we do dir to get all the files in that particular folder so we have the configuration xml file we have the setup xml we have the setup dot, dot e x e that's an extension so the next thing we do is that we run this particular last code that will install microsoft office for us so this is what we do we start by saying that we are about to run a setup so setup and then we use the forward slash configure uh, configure the configuration so don't forget it's a capital c configuration configuration dot xml that's all so you do setup so we are saying that run our setup file and configure the x so you are running the setup with the configuration file that we we we, we saved which is the configuration.xml then you hit enter once you hit enter this particular thing would open this pane would open microsoft and they will say we are getting things ready so we wait for this to start but then we cannot wait for that long period it would take you like i mean some minutes yeah if you only you are connected to a faster internet connection i mean internet source it would take you some minutes for the whole setup to to be done so we are getting things ready and after maybe at the end of the downloading process i'll i'll come back to you and then we complete the final part of the video so stay with me and let's go to the next chapter of the video so you realize that please stay online while microsoft 365 and office downloads so you 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 understand where we are going to now we are going to get microsoft 365 and office i mean just the features and we are going to be enjoying it you get it yeah yeah so now everything is done you are all set and the microsoft 365 and office apps are on your computer so we can try that now we can just see word and then uh so i think this is running perfectly well thank you very much for staying with me throughout the video and i really appreciate your time please don't forget to hit on that subscribe button and also don't forget to like the video and if there's anything please pass that comment in the comment section because i am always active there thank you for your time